The team at Timpunga will never forget the day Motambo arrived to the sanctuary. He was seriously injured, infected by tetanus and with no strength. The first hours were decisive. Bringing him back to life was not easy. It took days and nights of medication, attention and love. But Motambo wanted to live and together we helped him make it. But being alive is not enough. Freedom is waiting out there. Gombe Island is ready to receive some chimpanzees from the sanctuary. This dense forest will be their new home. They all left the dormitories for the first time. Motambo was among them. <coughs> They were excited, nervous, they could not believe it. Their feet stepping on fresh land, full of leaves and roots. The smells of the forest reminded them of the times when they were babies, free with their mothers, before becoming victims of poaching. This forest is perfect, full of new corners and mysteries to inspect by the chimpanzees. A place they can live with dignity after such a tragic childhood. Motambo will have to find his place within the hierarchy of the group. Make friends that can protect him from enemies, although Chimpunga caregivers will always be there, supporting him when he needs them. These chimpanzees now have a twinkle in their eyes. They seem to want to recover the time they lost away from the forest. This dream would not have been possible without the help of all partners and donors of the Jane Goodall Institute. <laughs>